have seen so many phalaenopsis orchid scare tips and find some of them work fairly but in most cases it's very much a goner so to say that the flowers may appear to be spent and wither away so here are the few cat tips which i would like to share here and hope you can <laughs> enjoy the flowers while it lasts so these are the ones that you should uh, pay attention and observe in any case uh, do not spray heavy water on their blooms you may lightly mist it but in most cases it's not so necessary and one of the reasons here is that the flowers appears to be a little bit more like a succulent kind of type and hence too much watering may cause them to have slight burns and may damage the flowers so if possible do not touch or spray anything on the blooms tip number two it's a very big no-no not to place these orchids in a direct hot scorching sun it will burn the flowers it will burn the lips leaves and it can even cause the whole plant to become stressed and the whole thing can just die and perish so don't place them in a shock especially in direct hot blazing sun number three is all about watering do not overwater these orchids especially the root ball because it behaves something like a succulent plant too much water can cause them to rot and may face fungus attract which more or less will make the plant perish within one to three weeks time so do not overwater it but just also do not underwater it in a way they have to observe and see that the root ball is slightly moist especially the sphagnum moss that in most cases this are actually planted with i do check on the medium that has actually been used because this is a very big uh, factor to take note of and finally do not water the crown of this orchid plant because the water may able to sit on the crown and may cause crown rot so these are the simple quick basic cat tips for these types of orchids. I'm James David and welcome to Garden Chronicles.